Good morning, St. Pius. Today is Thursday, March 16th, 2023. And happy St. Patrick's Day. Well, kind of. Happy birthday today to Annette Snyder, Faith Dorsalis, Maeve Crudo, and Tiernan Edwards. And then tomorrow we don't have school, so happy birthday to Shane Cohen and Matilda Kidd. High today, 46 degrees, so it's going to be much warmer than yesterday. Hopefully you brought your snow pants and your boots, because I know Mr. Shields was working pretty hard yesterday to give you guys something to play on outside in the snow. Hot lunch today, we have French toast or hummus box. After school clubs, we have drama club, math club. Today's a busy day celebrating St. Patrick's Day. At 9 a.m., uh, we'll have our bagpiper parade. I know it's a, a great tradition here at St. Pius. 10 a.m., we'll have our school mass. And then at 1.30, middle school, or should I say grade 6 through 8, you guys have your career fair. So we'll meet over in the gym at 1.30. And then, like I said, tomorrow, no school. Uh, so you guys can celebrate your St. Patrick's Day. So today we're going to remember how lucky we are to be here at St. Pius. In today's gospel, Jesus tells the parable of the true vine. The word abide means to remain or to stay. Jesus calls us to abide with him so that we can bear fruit. When we do good works in Jesus' name, we produce fruits of love, mercy, and compassion. When we do not live as Jesus wishes us to, we do not bear fruit. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine grower. He removes every branch in me that bears no fruit. Every branch that bears fruit he prunes to make it bear more fruit. You have already been cleansed by the word that I have spoken to you. Abide in me as I abide in you. Just as the branch cannot bear fruit by itself unless it abides in the vine, neither can you unless you abide in me. I am the vine, you are the branches. Those who abide in me and I in them bear much fruit, because apart from me you can do nothing. Whoever does not abide in me is thrown away like a branch and withers. Such branches are gathered, thrown into the fire, and burned. If you abide in me and my words abide in you, ask for whatever you wish, and it will be done for you. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Think about this today. Today's Gospel is all about uh, staying uh, attached to the vine so that we can grow and bear fruit. How can we stay or abide in Jesus? How can we remain close to Jesus today? And let us stand in prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great Thursday, everyone. A Thursday that feels like a Friday.